Alrighty guys, Axelon here, back with more Legend of Korra, the redo playthrough. Quick recap for those of you confused as to why you're seeing this, for all those, you know, long-time Enthusiax fans wondering why they're, they're seeing this game being done again on this channel. It's because my microphone back then kind of sucked. I mean, I, I, was, I was taking a cheap route at the time, just new to YouTubing. Um, so I'm, I'm basically just redoing this. Probably won't be the last game I do this on. Well, I just pick Legend of Korra first because it's a very short game. We're already halfway through it. So let's start Chapter 5. Enough talking from me for now. Looks like someone knew I was coming. All right, let's do this. <sighs> Bring it on! I've had enough of outsiders Let's go, air. and ruining my home. How do you parry a tornado? Come on! Seriously. How do you do it? Carry this. How did he survive? Cora, this might be an opportunity to get your firebending back. Focus your anger. Use it to bring back your firebending. You need to tap into the fire inside of me. And I got a lot of that. She does have a lot of that. Um... It's one of like the major differences between her and Aang was that she was a lot more uh, hot-tempered, whereas he was uh, more of a pacifist. Now we got that hot fire. I should probably lock on. That would probably help. Nope, invincibility frames, bitch. Then I'm headed to the spirit portal. I can't afford to meditate in. I'm going to need all my bending. I'm sorry for the, the in-game volume. That is as high as it will go. <laughs> Got it down 100% both in-game and in my uh, recording software. That's just... Them's the brakes. Really wish Mako and Bolin were here to help right now. Another firebender would be nice, even if it is my ex-boyfriend. Switch the error for these guys, actually. Basically, the same as the um, the triad gang members, just in dragonfly bunny spirit form. And the benefits of playing on extreme have a more diverse set of enemies. Dance of Death, once again. Let's switch to Firebending to take this final guy out. That way I'm not bumping into that chest. There we go. Break it open with some icicles. 
Icicles of Doom. It's an optional area, but fuck it. Let's go. Yep. Take care of these guys first. Got the robots. Let's punch them up in the air. Or not. Maybe I didn't finish the combo. Cora smash chest. Gonna ignore those guys. Kinda hit D, but oh well. Hi! 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 Got another optional area here. Ang's air glider. Well, I don't know if it's Ang's, but it's an air glider. <laughs> You've fallen right into my trap. Attacker! Sure you can. Where am I locked on to? Oh, because he's in the air, that's why. Let's break dancing. Oh, I... I zigged when I should have zagged. Get out of here. Okay, you want to play too. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. How are you parrying tornadoes? Since you know make. Starting to wonder if I should have left those spirit portals open after all. Hi. Oh boy. Let's go back to airbending. A lot of damage here. That's okay, got the robot. Hit me through the rock, that's okay. Still kicking. Not really targeting anything. Oh, I still got platinum out of all of that, really. Can't afford to be careless again, though. Wait. Is it... Is it this way? I think it is. No, it's the other way. Yeah, yeah, there's the big blue beam. Getting worse. I better get moving. Hi. What the? Oh, 
was unexpected. What is it about the South Pole that brings all the crazy people out? Big group, let's stick with air. Air is best for crowd control. Down with the avatar. Think you can stop me? Think again. Sure you can. Break dance here. DDR. Somehow they got through the, the wind and punched me. That's fine. I don't think so. Eat tornado. Ah, I let go at the last second. All right, let's go. Let's go to Earth. Yeah, now we're gonna do some damage. Now we're doing the damage. Come on. Ah, oh, this is no 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 fun. No fun. Ah! Come on. Not that. Not that. Just try to run me over. Come on. There we go. M one more time. One more time. There we go. Fatality. To the portal. So th this mission, I think, is actually the hardest. Level 5. It's only because you have a combination of... Well, okay, you'll see. Let's get going, Naga. Right, let's go ahead and try to speed this up. Probably not the best decision to make. I'll probably crash because of this. Alright. I think we're just gonna keep it to the regular speed for now. Lots of twists and turns on this course. So, uh, trying to be a bit to err on the side of caution. In fact, rather not repeat this stage again. Yeah, and, and uh, Naga can just destroy small obstacles. Oh! Oh no! Didn't even see that pit. Ah, oh, I just got myself a silver. There we go. Speed things up.
And we're past. Oh, I still got a gold. Amazing. But this is why I think this is the hardest level. Okay, let's this is going. very unforgiving. You're basically like running and fighting three mecha tanks. And because we're on extreme, you get one shot. If they hit you once, you're dead. Three mecha tanks. Well, I, I have a water shield, so I can take two hits. Fire bending to recharge, there we go. So we got fire bending again. I can destroy obstacles, but the fire obscures your view, which is why I prefer just dodging them. They're not too difficult to dodge once you know how to read the signs. Once you know how to read their moves, this level becomes a bit easier. You don't even need firebending at all in, in this level, though. You really don't. It certainly makes things easier, but uh, you can you can literally just claw them to death if you uh, have the the patience and the stamina. Oh come on! Okay, I still got it. One more. And if you guys think this is hard, try doing it like with like only, only uh, earth bending or something. No time to and we even got a platinum. That's awesome. I don't think I've ever gotten a platinum on this before. left those spirit portals open after all. Sure you can. Ah. Up. And counter. Break dance them a bit. Cora, remember your airbending training in the spinning gates. You're right. If I can avoid enough of their attacks, maybe I'll remember. All right, you want you want these guys. 
they're, they're, they're the easiest to dodge and they give you lots of attacks to dodge. This is where you unlock airbending. Oh, that one guy got a lucky punch in. And then, like, I don't understand, like, this this thing. Like, one spirit shows up. And you can't you can't spirit bend it. Basically, you just keep punching it. This, uh, like in the stores, because you don't have spirit bending back. And then, like, multiple ones start showing up. This leads to a cutscene where you get overwhelmed. You know, you can destroy them just fine, even without spirit bending. Sure you can. Can't beat these things without my spirit bending. Okay, regular airbender glider staff, not Angs. Okay, so chapter five was almost twenty five minutes. So we're gonna rebuy our Oasis water. We had to use one. Uh, I guess I didn't buy that already. Might as well buy that. Might as well buy out the whole store except for the pro bending mode thing. Thank you. Come again. I'm home. I have to equip items before I can use them. Hmm. What to wear to? So, because we're at the 25 minute mark, almost. I'm gonna go ahead and call it here. Chapter five is a bit of a longer chapter than some of the other ones. Uh, we still have chapters 6, 7, and 8 left to go. This is where we go to the spirit world next. This is where we relearn our spirit bending. Um, we get some more problematic camera angles here in a little bit, but that's for the next video. Until then, I hope you guys have enjoyed this replay through of uh, The Legend of Korra by Platinum Games. Um, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe if you haven't already, and of course visit, uh, visit us at our main website enthusiasts.com. We have some, some uh, forums you can swing by, post with our community. And that's all I got, so this is Axelon signing out. Have a good one.